Hello people of the internet. It's been, I'm so sorry pig, um, another video. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. I'm so sorry. That was the biggest mistake ever. I'm sorry. Look at this. So I've got a fringe gap. It's going to annoy me this whole video and it's probably going to annoy you now that I've mentioned it. But today we're going to do a spooky, scary video and that video is going to be another unboxing of the Kawaii box because I loved the last one so much and I had so much fun opening it and I really do think it is a nice monthly treat to receive. So they have sent me their special Halloween box for this month and if you look in the description there'll also be a little giveaway. I'm worn out after doing that jump. That was like two seconds of activity. Why am I out of breath? Jesus, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Before I start the video, however, I do have a new friend for the background. As you can see, I've made just a little bit of room. God, I'm out of breath. <laughs> and um, he's very, very special. And I'm really hoping that you will give him the most warmest of welcomes because he is one of the cutest ones I've ever seen. Soy frog. Look at I'm sorry, I just can't resist. How adorable is this? So this is from the shop Zokai. I really hope that's the, pro the way to pronounce it. I don't realise how things, how hard things are to say until I say it on here and then I'm like, I don't know how to talk anymore. How do I say my own name? But this is the cutest dang frog. He's just been released. I literally received him today and I thought, how could he not be in the background? He belongeth. There we go. Is that appropriate? I feel like that is a very appropriate background. So it's spooky, scary season. Um, I love Halloween from afar. Um, <laughs> it's not really that big a thing in UK, but I do still enjoy seeing the costumes, seeing the spooky things, seeing the spooky merchandise. But I can't say that I'll be going to any Halloween parties of any sort because I um, don't really get invited. And also, I am so busy with uni, I want to cry. So, um... I don't have a Halloween costume. This Maybe this is my Halloween costume. Maybe I am a spooky um, weeb with my anime top on. So there you go. Spooky weeb, the most scary thing of all. So let's just get on. Let's just get straight cracking into the unboxing. First thing that is laid on top is the Halloween party. Just to remind you which box it is and what the theme is. So we've got the cute little girl there. The little character that is in all of the kawaii boxes. And some pictures of some cute people unboxing it and looking really happy and really surprised and ooh la la what's in this box which will be me very soon they also they had one of these last time blippo is like a cute stationery shop they've got a lot of damn cute things on there so i would go and check them out and with this you get a free kawaii gift with any purchase using a coupon code so everyone gets a coupon code which is really cool i know there was a coupon code last time for blippo as well so Maybe that's something you get every time. I'm not actually too sure. I will remove the fun tissue with you, my friend, and we shall see what is within us. Ooh, ooh. Mmm, okay, right, there's a lot happening. I can see many a thing. The first thing I can see that's like the biggest is this. Is this like a chocolate? That is flipping cute. What is he? A little koala. A little spooky koala. See, I like this stuff. Maybe I'm not as into like really scary Halloween stuff where it's like a man, his arms are hanging off and it's like a scary film and then I just want to cry and I can't sleep. But I really like spooky things that are like, it's a dog dressed as a ghost. And I'm like, oh, he's so scary. That's the kind of Halloween stuff that I enjoy. Like the cute Halloween stuff, you know, like I put a hat on my hamster, my hamster's a witch. It's like funny. That's what I like, not the really scary stuff. So this is really cute. These are like chocolate filled little biscuits. They kind of look like the Hello Panda ones. Hello Panda little biscuits. They're flipping delicious. So that's the first thing, a spooky, scary treat within. So the next thing, he's from Moomin. What is this? I'm not actually too sure who this character is, but it is Moomin. And he is a little thing with our... <laughs> he's like right up my alley, to be honest. I think he's very cute. He's got two very big hands for holding, hold his little hands. Key ring, you can put him on your bag. So that's very, very cute. So I don't know what this character is from Moomin. I'm not actually that like, I don't really know that much about the Moomin culture. The culture's probably not the right word at all, is it? I don't know that much about Moomin, to be honest, apart from like the very main characters. So maybe this is a character, if you know his name, let me know. But otherwise, I'm going to call him Gregory. So meet Gregory, everyone, a little spoopy ghost. <laughs> little spoopy ghost friend. He's very cute and he's very soft as well. So I can see on here as well, we have another sweet or biscuit. It feels like a wafer. 
and it just says Happy Halloween. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know exactly what it is, but I can tell you the packaging is very, very cute. It's all in Japanese, so who knows? Who really knows what that is? Now, this is very, 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 very cute. This is a giant badge of a spoopy ghost. This is so cute. I think this one was kind of like you get a random one and there's like loads of different designs. That is so cute. Oh my god, I actually really love her. She's like, oh, I spook you, maybe. Maybe, but I'm a little bit shy, so I might not spook you at all. That's what she looks like. She looks like she's kind of like, she might spook, but she's kind of not too sure. And if it's a cute boy, she might be like, oh, I don't think I can spook him. You know, that's what she looks like. A shy anime girl, ghost. She's adorable. It's a very big badge, but it is super dang cute. It's really, really cute. And I feel like this is something, you know, it's a spooky ghost. Ghost horn all year round. You can wear this all year round, surely. Ghosts don't just appear on Halloween, they appear all year round. Speaking of which, if you've got any fun ghost stories, I've definitely asked you all this before in like one of my first videos, but if anyone's got any fun ghost stories, please can you let me know because I love to read spooky ghost stories. I don't really have any myself. I feel like I've seen things, but I'm also don't really believe myself because I think there's a high possibility that my brain is just overactive and that I probably, my brain could have just made something up and made me see it. Like how could I, I don't believe my own brain. Is that normal? Maybe that's not normal. But if you've got a spooky ghost story, please let me know in the comments because I've, le I've left tonight. So yeah, there's that, a bit off topic, but I enjoy. This is Scratch Note. Don't know what that means, but let's have a look. Scratch Note, is this like the black, oh. Ooh, it comes with uh, what looks like a chopstick and a pad and all it says in English is scratch note. Is this like a... Oh, wow. So you use the little piece of wood to scratch the black layer and underneath is like a shiny thing. I'm going to draw you a magnificent drawing. And I want you to comment down below and say that I will be the next huge artist, the next Picasso, dare I say. And you can see I've got a little heart and I've drawn a little tiny pig. That is fantastic. So you scratch it away, look. And you can see it makes like a silver underneath. Oh yes, this was rainbow, look. Oh, so they have like different like... Okay, let me do like a... That's so funky actually. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. How cute is that? No, it's a little hard. It's rainbow on the inside. So it's got loads of different patterns on each page. This would be super fun for the youngsters as well. So if you're buying this box as a mama or a bit younger, you'll probably really flip it enjoy this. But I have the brain of a 10 year old, so I enjoy this and I just flew my chopstick along. Wonderful activity for all the family. There you go. So next we've got like, this is, oh, this is cute now. Now we're down my alley. This is like a makeup bag um not very halloweeny but oh it feels really nice as well a really cute cosmetic makeup bag with a beautiful unicorn on this is flipping adorable and it feels really really soft as well and thick oh yes it's all lined on the inside with pink which is really cute so i guess you could use it as a pencil case as well or like a makeup bag something to put in your bag carry your bits and bobs but i am a huge lover of just random bags to store things in i'm a big fan of organization i'm a big fan of every single little pellet having a place i love i love it i live for it i'm a virgo and i live for it but this is right down the alley it's very cute this is definitely going to get used like a lot because it's so dang cute i love a little unicorn yay so that's pretty cute. That's a really fun item. Oh, there's more! Oh my god, okay, there's quite a lot. Wow. We have a pen. Um, I've noticed that I've got a little bit of black on my fingers from that <laughs> sketching thing, but you're gonna get a bit messy with the crafts. It's just how it goes. So this is a really cute pen. It's like a ghost cat. He won't focus. There we go. Beauty guru hand pose. A adorable little black ghost cat which is really cute and it's a little pen so I have another pen um, well they, they had a few pens in the last box and I've been using them a lot because it's 
I'm a big lover of stationery. Look, I'm a really exciting person. I don't get invited to Halloween parties. I love organisation and I flipping love stationery. That's what I live for. They're my true passions. So I love the last pen that I got. It was a little, um, like a mountain pen with all the sprinkles in it. And it's really, really cute. And honestly, that pen is really, really good. I've even been using it for like drawing, like a fine liner, because it's such a nice fluid pen. So honestly, I really rate their pens. I think they're really cool. So I can say from experience, I enjoy their pens. They get a good review from me. So how adorable, a little spooky ghost cat just for Halloween. And then there's more going on. This is, what is this? It's like glitter. And oh, it's a clip. Oh, that's cool. So in here we have like this um, little, the packaging is really, really adorable. So this is from Blippo, which is that shop I was literally just talking about. So as you can see, it's got two little, um, bits the metal bits to slide into your hair it's filled with confetti and it's a cute little star in the bun looks oh okay actually kind of living for that that is actually really cute okay yeah so we have a little star it's a little shake star it's filled with fun cute things so you can have a if you do a roly-poly then it's all going to shake about and it will look really cute so another thing this is what seems to look like a book of mark shine like the rainbow so this is a really cute bookmark with all the sprinkly sprinklers in. Very cute, very adorable. It says stay, if I can get them out of the way. The little snowflakes out of the way. I think it says stay beauty. Yeah, stay beauty it says. And it's filled with all these sprinklers. Very cute. Got a piece of ribbon at the top as well. So another nice piece of stationery to enjoy. And then last but not least, we've got some more dang stickers, which is great because I thought the other stickers that we got last time, which were little flipping astronauts, were really cute. But by gosh, these are cuter. These are actually amazing. So we've got this really cute pack of stickers. Look how flipping adorable. And already I can tell you that I'm really drawn and emotionally connect to this little sad ghost bear. How cute. And these are like the puffy ones as well, like touchy-feely ones. Flipping fantastic. They're actually so cute. And then we've got this little ghost in the tongue look. And then like the genie and they're just so cute oh i freaking love them so that's the end of the box if that's everything that came within the box and um, i really hope you enjoyed it i definitely did i really think it's a really cute fun subscription box everything's different it's a good variety of items it's really fun so i really enjoyed opening that it's like a little present every month isn't it which is really fun so if you like that box you can have a chance to win said box as well there'll be a little uh, link down below to enter a fun giveaway in partnership with them and they will send a, the chosen winner the same box so we can have a matching box which is so fun and so cute so thank you very much kawaii box for working with me again because i honestly really did enjoy opening that it's just so fun and i love my little star friend and i love my little um my little tiny ghost friend so um, I hope that you have a very spooky Halloween and you don't get too scared and if you go trick-or-treating then you collect many a sweet and with that being said enjoy the rest of your day, your night, your evening, whatever time zone you're in. Remember to stay hydrated, get plenty of sleep and love yourself always. Goodbye!